Lead is a love letter to black boys in Atlanta. Our mission statement reads uh, to empower an at-risk generation to lead and transform their city of Atlanta, putting an emphasis on their city. And we do this by using the sport of baseball to teach black boys how to overcome what we call three curveballs that threaten their success, and that's crime, poverty, and racism. We are really good at what we do. We have 45 major leaguers that we've developed, including Jason Hayward, Dexter Fowler, Charlie Coberson. The baseball piece, that's the easy piece, but we're talking about how do we use it to develop the values and the virtues so that black boys can become major league citizens without having to relocate. <laughs> so for a, a black boy that comes into our system, you're gonna be protected, you're gonna learn how to participate, you're gonna learn how to practice, you're gonna learn how to play, and then you're gonna learn how to perform. You're gonna go through that progression of performance and we're gonna guide you every step of the way and everything that you have earned, you're gonna get. I can't, I can't say that you're gonna get a, a scholarship to this college or that college, but I will guarantee that you're gonna get the opportunity to get the yes or the no. And that no is not gonna be because you're black. I've seen more black boys see their value and see their worth. And once you can get somebody to see their value and see their worth, they start making different decisions about their life. And that's where, you know, our sport education, cultural literacy of Lee all comes together because we don't just talk about Hank Aaron and how he, you know, hit 755 home runs. We talk about Mr. Aaron and how he had to fight against segregated housing in spring training. So this man is on his job, but he still has a bigger social fight relative to racial discrimination. So helping our boys understand their value personally, but also corporately as part of their community and ultimately as part of the world has been one of the greatest joys um, of my you know, professional career. I really hope that we can have a, a carved out space for sports-based youth development with, with LEAD being the MVP of that. Having that LEAD Center for Youth then will allow us to have 500 black boys that we will say, you are protected, dream on, and we'll be able to make those dreams become a reality.